Good morning, a very early morning. I can't believe the day has arrived. It's finally arrived. I am going on a Disney cruise. I'm going on a Disney wish. And yeah, it's kind of sinking in. Not really sink. I mean, that's, a, that's the wrong word to use. Uh, maybe not sink. Um, but uh, my bag has just been collected. So if you haven't been watching um, my recent vlog series from Walt Disney World. I am staying at the All Star Music Resort. My bag has just been collected at 7am there, taken away uh, by uh, baggage handlers to the cruise and I'm getting the cruise line bus um, over to the, the ship. I think it's about half past nine, 9.45 the bus leaves, but I'll be early down at the lobby just in case to make sure. So yeah, I cannot wait. Um, next couple of days, I'm going to be on the Disney Wish, stopping off at all these uh, different places. Um, so yeah, join me today for embarkation day. Going on the, the, the bus, getting on board the ship, seeing my room, seeing the ship, and setting sail. Um, yeah, I cannot wait. So join me today um, and for the next couple of days on Disney Wish. Let's go and have amazing time. So backpack is ready to go, bags away like I say it's coming up for 8.30 just now am. What's the weather? Weather check. So far so good but as you know if you've watched my series this week that can change very quickly so yeah I'm going to head down to the lobby just now it's half past eight, maybe a wee bit early, but let's go down. I want to make sure that I'm there and I know what's going on and I'm not leaving things last minute rushing around. So, yeah, I'm going to get my bag on, head down to the lobby um, and get on the coach to the cruise. Yeah, so let's go. So, final checks completed. Let's go on the wish. I need to come and say goodbye to the drum that I have been walking through. So, just seems fitting to say goodbye. I don't know if I'm going to get something to eat just now or just wait. I'm not sure. I might get some snacks on a bag. So I still don't know if I'm in the right bit. But I'm guessing I am. I'm right in the corner area of the lobby. Just up there is the sign that says Disney Cruise Line. And there is a rep floating around, so I'm just going to sit about here just now. I'm just going to take it all in and wait for the motions to move. And uh, yeah, that's really it just now. I might get some snacks for my bag for food. But I'm too excited to, to eat. <laughs> Checked in with the rep, and since it's about a 45 minute wait to get the bus, I'm going to get a sandwich, I think. Let's go for a turkey. And I'm going for a chocolate milkshake. Chocolate. Is that a milkshake? Chocolate milk. Something different. Ugh. So I have about a half an hour to eat my sandwich and then go on the bus. It's about an hour and a half trip to the cruise. Cannot wait. Cannot wait to eat this. Look at that. <laughs> had this before, uh, a few years ago, it was really nice, I'm being healthy for a change. So yeah, not long now. Once again, I really enjoyed that sandwich. I don't know why I got chocolate milk, it's not like me. I think it's because it's, I'm going to say it, it's moo, 
and improved. See it? Yeah, I know. Great. Let's go get the bus. Oh, the bus has arrived. It is here. It's time to get on board. Thank you. Right to the back. <laughs> there we go. So once you check in with the rep in the lobby, you need to show uh, ID afterwards. So just before you go on the bus, you need to show some ID. So I'll show my passport. Take it on the bus. So hour and a half trip over to a Disney cruise. In a few minutes, this motor coach is going to depart here and be heading to All Star Sports. We're going to make the final pickup and then you'll be on your way out to the port. It is about an hour and a half ride out to the port. your proof of citizenship out and in your hand before you enter the terminal. That would be your passport or birth certificate with driver's license. But you do need to have those out in your hand, not in a backpack. They do not, you don't need passport and license. You only need your license if you brought a birth certificate. If you have passport, that's all you need. Um, also, before you go into the terminal, you cannot have any open liquids. If you have an open bottle of water, open bottle of pop, it does need to be dumped. And we have grass right straight ahead, where the, right where you're going to be walking to go to the terminal. If you would dump it out in the grass, please. Also, open food. They don't allow any open food, oranges, apples, that type of thing, in the terminal. So you would have to throw those away as well. So remember to have your proof of citizenship in your hand and no open liquids of any kind, not even in a personal cup that needs to be dumped. Check your surroundings before you get off the bus and make sure you have, didn't drop a wallet, a telephone. Make sure you've got your children with you. They're all going with you. Okay, I'm ready to go for the cruise? All right, let's go. You're gonna walk down here and meet another cast member. Let's go on a cruise. through the security check and just about to go and wait for my boarding group to get on the cruise so I would highly recommend checking in online 
early before your trip so you can print off your boarding pass and you don't have to check in up here after free security just give you time to relax and chill I have been given a boarding number of 7 so I'm just waiting for my boarding uh, number to be called and then we can get on board Woo, cannot wait cannot wait It's so true in it what they say. You just don't know it until you experience it yourself. It just looks very, very well it is very elegant. Just look at that there. Right, I am going to explore the ship. I have no idea where I'm going. But let's go anyway. I don't know why, but I'm just gonna walk all the way to the top. Because it just feels and seems right. Go up to the top and then we'll have a look outside. Overlooking the port. Just look at the decor. Please welcome aboard the BS Marcus family. Please welcome aboard the Connor family. Please welcome aboard the BS uh, family. So cool. So, so cool. Very fancy. These are the first doors I've came to, so oh, magic, just like magic. <laughs> this is just crazy. Ah, oh, so so cool, so surreal. I'm gonna go back inside to see if I can go the other side. Oh. I have no idea where I'm going. I'm just walking around Luna. Looks nice. Don't know if that's like a sh yeah, it's like a stage there. Ah, this is cool. Upstairs and downstairs with the stage. Right, I'm gonna get back outside. As well as being very, very nice and very, very fancy, it's spotless, very, very clean. Just to give you an idea of the time just now, so it's half past twelve. I think the boat departs about half past three. So, got a bit of time to walk around, take it all in. What I'm going to do is I'm also a, kind of a spoiler a little bit, but information that you should know. I'm going to book a Disney, crew, Disney bus, Disney World Resort bus back to the resort because I'm going back to Disney World after this trip. So I'll show you where to do that, how to do that. You're better as soon as you, as soon as you come on uh, board, 
go to the guest relations straight away, guest services, and then you can book your bus back. Don't forget, don't leave it last minute. I don't know if I can go up these stairs, can I? I want to. I wanna, I've had to come out this side of the ship because I couldn't go out the doors on the other side. Let's have a look. Can I go up? Looks like I can. Even more stairs. I'm going up again. I want to go right to the front. Wow! Look at this. Spa area, little jacuzzis. This is incredible. I can't believe I'm here. Just look at that there. Ah. Oh. Absolutely breathtaking. I have mean, no words. I have no words. So I'm going down the many stairs to head back inside. We even get some food. My first Disney Wish Lift experience. Doors closing. Oh, no, not close. Doors opening. Um, I don't know where I'm going here. Doors oh. closing. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> Incredible. Deck six, doors opening. Hello <laughs> <Hold> again. <laughs> oh, that's good to know. <laughs> Are you just wandering too? Yep. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> A view is this, that's the aqua mouse you can go in, which is a, a water slide. May go on that on this trip. What do you think? I'm absolutely blown away. I'm up in the adult section only. Yeah. Don't know what to expect, but still speechless. Still can't believe I'm on this. I think I'm gonna get a drink. Just a normal drink. Uh, I don't really drink anyway, alcohol, but um, yeah, I'm gonna get a drink, maybe an ice cream or something to keep me cool. So, yeah, let's go and do that. So, I got cheeseburger, fries, and a coke. It's all free, when you pay for it, just in case you're wondering if you haven't been on because before like myself. So I'm going to relax, chill at this window just now and take it all in. Oh. Still can't believe I'm on this ship. Just look at that. And it's not raining yet, so I'll take that as a big bonus. But I said yet. Yeah. Oh. Early days, very early days. So, the burger was okay, but um, it's edible, it's not too not bad, um, and I enjoyed it because I was hungry, um, and it's, it's, a, it's free as part of the package. So yeah, ice cream. Before I even get ice cream, wait to have a look at this place. Or how exploring. This is the rose. I've heard all about it, oh wow. I've heard it's really fancy, but 
That's, yeah, very elegant. I'm guessing Beauty and the Beast themed. This is really fancy in here. Look at this. It just keeps on going and going and going. We're through those doors. It's Paolo. Here's the Paolo. Spring. This feels like I have to. Very, very fancy. Oh, my. Very nice. Very, very nice. Have you ever? In your wildest dreams, see anything as fancy as this? I've heard so much about it, but yeah, when you see it in person, very elegant. I'm not going to be eating here on this trip, maybe another time, but yeah, nice. And you get a soup. Right, let's keep walking, let's keep exploring. I cannot get into my room until. Well, 2 o'clock, so half past 1 just now, so my room should be ready for 2pm, so we can have a look around my room. I've come to the other side of the ship to take a few obligatory Instagram photos, so I'll post them on Instagram, Facebook, and photos of me around the ship. If you want to follow me, all my details are in the description box down below. This is amazing up here. So many different places you can sit and just sit and chill out of the way that you would never ever think. Still families and folk and everyone coming on to the ship. It's coming up for 2 pm. Good new characters now. So. <laughs> So I'm just I'm loving this, I'm just walking around taking it all in. Apologies if it's all over the place, but yeah. So good. I have just noticed the Star Wars Hyperspace Lounge. That's on level 3 by the looks of it, so I'm going to go to level 3 and check that out. I've heard good things about that as well. And we are here, look at this. Hyperspace Lounge. So, we need to just subscribe <laughs> and I will be back. So, just before I go to my room, and we can check out the room in a moment, I mentioned about the bus, so I will be getting the Disney Cruise bus back to the resort after the cruise. I don't want to think about after the cruise just yet because I'm just starting, but the best way I can put it, I don't want to record too much for obvious reasons, um, but when you walk onto the boat, got the spiral staircase. And your first level there, you've got the guest service desks. Just go to that desk there and book your bus to get back to the resort. If you're staying at the resort, or even if you're looking to go to back to the airport and use their bus service. Uh, but do it as soon as you come on, is my recommendation because um, you want to get a seat. So, why don't we go and check out my room? Because I believe there's an emergency drill. This is the upcoming activities and events. You'll find these screens on the walls. Um, yeah, I don't know what time that is. I need to double check what time that's at. So there's the mandatory guest assembly point, 3.55. So I'm going to head to my room and we'll check the room out. And yeah, we'll start go from there. Go to the assembly point and then we'll go to the sail away uh, presentation, the sail away party. Uh, as we leave the dock. So it's currently half past two and I'm walking down these amazing hallways. So, so nicely. Oh, I just 
feel so weird. So I have found my room. I'm on the 10th floor. Oh, there we go. Well, let's put lights on. Oh, what's going on here? So, we will be going to an emergency point. I'm going to put this on mute just now. Just to... Oh, this. This is really nice. I've got a, a veranda. This is a deluxe stateroom, I believe. I'll check that in a minute. <laughs> I'm just kind of overwhelmed with everything that's going on just now. Just try to take it all in. I will do like more of a. Oh, well, I'll probably do a separate video, let's be honest, on my channel. <laughs> um, well, let's show the view just now at least. Show the view. What's going on here? Yeah. Oh, that's a bit weird. How's that? That's strange. Am I sharing with someone else? What is that? I think it does close over. It looks like it closes over. Check that in a moment. Not a bad view. Not a bad view at all. And the weather, of course, is awesome. Just look at that. I like it. I like this room. Got Moana as well. Picture there. Oh, let's do a little tour then. Eh? So, front door. <laughs> Sliding wardrobe doors. Oh, rope. Yeah, a Disney Cruise rope. I've got two of them. So I'm going to wear both of them at the same time. Leaf jackets up there. Slide to open. Lots of storage space. It's safe there. More hanging space with hangers. And behind me here, do we have... Oh, there's a toilet separate. So separate toilet. It's really cool. Good idea, some shelving up there. Towels, sea salt, hand soap. What's that for? Sharp waist only. A little bin in there, towel. Shelving, mirror, me. Charging point. Yeah, it's nice. Just get everything you need. Everything I need anyway. So, yeah, it's. So cool, so cool being on board. It's been a long time coming this. I can't actually believe I'm walking around my room just now. So, a little bath, look, a little bath. I'll never fit in that. I can try, but I would never get back out. So, it looks like a nice shower. In here, your body wash, sea salt body wash. It's conditioner and shampoo. Disney Cruise Line sea salt bath soap. Some towels, give you a makeup towel. <laughs> towels, spin, tissues. 
all that stuff, body lotion, me again, mirror, ideal, it's absolutely ideal, as you come in here, bed looks awesome, I just want to jump on that just now, but I will not get back up and I'll miss all the action, uh, down here USB points, socket, lights, oh, just blind myself, Does the let's put, I didn't put the main light on yet. Let's put this on. Oh, that's off. That's on. It just didn't seem that bright. And here you got phone, tissues, remote control, bin, drawer. Ooh, I'm keeping that pen. <laughs> Straight to the pen. Look at that. Look at these pictures, these, are they postcards? Yeah, they're keeping them. And you can even post them as well. That's nice. Paper. Information. Mirror ceiling. Oh, some separate light in there. Some lights going on there and off in the balcony lights as well. The little drawers, the hair dryer there, storage space, another storage space. Is that a fridge? That is a fridge. It's a drawer fridge. Some glasses. This is cool. Love this. I believe that's a pull out bed. Well, couch into a bed and you can move what's that announcement going across there you can move that there uh, here you have a little drawer some charging points, USBs and whatnot. some light switches and all that stuff so yeah this is this is really cool again if I forget to tell you any information, I'll put all the information down below in the description box as much as I can in regards to the room the, and the, the cruise. This is just so bizarre that I'm actually here. Right, I'm going to just chill for like two minutes, five minutes and um, yeah, just take all this in. And, uh, We'll have that. Have to go to that emergency uh, thing. Do you call it emergency assembly? And then uh, the sail away. So, oh, this is so good to be here. So, if you're watching, still watching, thank you for watching. So much more to come. So much more to come. Yeah. So, yeah. See you soon. <laughs> I'm gonna go chill for five minutes. So I've had some chill time, maybe 10, 15 minutes are coming up um, at 20 past 3 just now. So I want to show you some more things that I'm starting to see now across the water. Just look over there, you can see Cape Canaveral, NASA. A big building over there is the main NASA building. And you'll just see it at the centre of the screen. Right there. This would be a great view to watch a rocket launch. Just shows you how big that building actually is, even from here. And I've seen it up close when I went to a tour of NASA. Still very overwhelming. Um, but yeah, soon I'll be going on the, well, going down to the emergency. Um, assembly point and I don't think I can really record much that can I? I don't know if I can record that or not but I'm going to go do that and then we can catch up afterwards um, there's just so much to take in this is my first time and I'll tell you more uh, information in fact I'll tell you just now actually information um, 
more information. Let me get my phone because it's better to show you on the, the app as well. So let me show you just now. So this is the kind of daily itinerary and travel uh, plan. So today we're at Port Canaveral, about to leave the port. Then we go to Nassau, which is in the Bahamas. And then we go to Disney's Castaway Cay, their own private island. And then we go back to Port Canaveral. I don't want to give too much away there because I have a few surprises coming up. So, yeah, you just need to stay tuned, see what happens, what, what I go up to over these next couple of days. And if you want to find out more as well, I will be exploring the ship more. There's so much more to show on the ship. I can't show it all um, in one day, it's just impossible. So I'm going to spread it out as uh, the week is a weekend. So this is currently Friday. So as the weekend goes and as the trip goes, I will show more. So don't worry, stay tuned. I will show you more areas of the ship and all that stuff, all the kind of as much detail and stuff, and I can I can show. Hopefully, I don't miss anything. I probably will, uh, because it's my first time, and there'll be things that other folk will know who are watching this. So, if you do know anything, leave some comments down below for others to to find out uh, as well. So, yeah, I'm going to chill for another five minutes, and then I'm going to head down to the emergency assembly point and get that done, and then we can get on with our night. It's time to go to buy the signs and directions of the emergency assembly point, which is assembly point E, I believe. Here are the instructions yeah. for so, your life First, let's go to assembly point E. May I have your attention, please? The mandatory the emergency drill has now begun. So, emergency drill assembly point complete. You've got the Royal Caribbean. What's that? The Mariner of the Seas is off. If betters, they're out. They're gone, and we will be gone out of port very soon. A very good afternoon, everyone, and welcome aboard the beautiful Disney Wish. This is Captain Andy speaking from the bridge. So, just a quick update for you all. Uh, Andy sounds you're Scottish. You Scottish, Andy? Departure, the checks, and we do expect to be letting go lines in about 25 minutes from now. I think he is. And once all lines are on board, we will sail eastwards through Port Canaveral into the Florida Strait and onwards towards Nassau. And the speed required as we head down towards Nassau is around 18.5 knots and I expect to be docked safely alongside at around 9.15. This is so cool. Right, I'm going to head to the sailing away party. So let's go and have a sail away party and enjoy leaving the dock. Let's go. Oh, big echo. Echo! Are you excited for your new fun and magical adventure? Hello, my name is Emily and I'm part of the entertainment team here on the Disney Wish. And we are so happy to have you here for the next three fun filled days. And we want to meet you. Shake to the beat and share your fancy dreams with your new Disney Cruise Line family. Here to get the party started, it's Lewis! Thank you, Emily! Disney Wish, are we ready for vacation? <laughs> Disney Wish, I want to hear you shout it so loud, so proud, that Captain Minnie can hear you all the way on the bridge. So after three, one, Two, three! Oh. That was awesome! All right, you ready? On the count of three. One, two, three! Three, 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 three
faces. And I see some of you have your wishing wands. <laughs> Together, we can make even the biggest wishes come true. <gasps> like setting sail. <laughs> Let's see what our magic can do. Wands up. Repeat after me. Wishes do come true. Ready? Wishes do come true! was at the pool on deck 11 I've had to run <laughs> down the stairs to get to where I am just now look how far away we are from the port already go all the way there moving very quickly I've came back to this location to see if we can see anyone going by and give them a wave sorry for the wind, it is windy it's a bit of wind and we're moving now, so let's see if I can see some people over there. I'm really hoping they, they play the horns as we leave. That would be really, really cool. That would be really awesome. They play the horns, come on. So I'll try and keep it as long as I can just to keep it. I'll try and keep it as entertaining as possible. But yeah, this is this is so cool. Just cruising away here. I really don't want to miss the horn and that's why I'm playing this. There's people over there just now. I don't know if they can see me or see us. I'm waving, waving. <laughs> ah, seen you. Ah, seen you. I waved. Is anyone 
waving. crowd there. What's that? Fish lips. Fish lips, waterfront, bar and grill. <laughs> I'm sorry about the wind. That's going to be really loud, that wind, but it's worth it. So, so worth it. Come on, play the horn if anyone wants to uh, look they're all making the horn suggestion. Come on. Play the horn. Play the horn. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Everyone wants to hear it. I don't think there's anyone on the other side. It looks like there's just other ports. I'm not sure. Don't see anyone on the other side, as in like over there. On that side. I think we're all kind of port works now, it's all ports. Don't see any like kind of civilians. That would have been really cool if we played the horn. One of the pilot boats, making sure we're all safe as we leave. Just look at that view right there, look at that. See if I can go back this way and look back the way. This is going to be a long, long video. So apologies in advance. Just look at that there. Lots of words for a change. I am really, really lost of words. <laughs> yep. I'm scared to stop the recording because of I don't want to miss the horns if I do play. I think there's people actually right at the end there as well. Is that like a pier? Possibly. I see cars parked. Can't see it yet, but you'll see it shortly as we come closer. I think, it's, I think it's cars. I think it's people waiting to see the crews going by. Oh, it just feels so strange actually being on the cruise when I was, went to go and see it before. Not the wish, but 
yeah, it's totally bizarre feeling being on the cruise. I might have actually spoiled myself now coming on a cruise. That I'm always going to be on a cruise just now, but that's what they say. They say that about Walt Disney World, and it's true. And they say that about cruises for a Disney Cruise. And I've not even left, technically left the port yet, really. And I'm saying that. I'm just standing in the shade just now because it is very, very warm. Is that a casino? That's not a casino. A casino ship? A casino boat? Is it? I didn't think that was a thing. Victory Casino Cruises. There you go. Victory. I could just stand here for the full duration of this trip. Just take this in. Absolutely stunning. Some people are there. One's waving. <laughs> Everyone's waving back. This is what I like. It just uh, brings out just joy in everyone. Wow! Now we're playing the horn. <laughs> I hope that's picking that up. This is awesome. Honestly, this is just so cool. I don't know why I like it so much, but it's just to see everyone happy about the same thing. Just look at that coastline. This is going to be one very long video. Hopefully you're still awake. Hopefully you're enjoying it. And there we have it, looking back. We are just leaving Port Canaveral. bag has arrived. I've only spotted it because it was 20 doors in the opposite direction. It was nowhere near my room and I've got a, a letter of some sort. But I've got a drink in my hand so I'm going to open the door and let's get inside. Well I just opened up the little thing that was on my door and it was supposed to be a surprise but oh, I can say now I suppose. Um, I had booked an excursion or an adventure, they call it a port adventure, and I'll turn the camera around and I'll read it out. This is me just getting told now, which is strange. Welcome aboard, please be informed that the 
So the Blackbeard Revenge Pirate Ship Adventure at Nassau has been cancelled due to low participation. A full refund will be applied. Yeah, so... Uh, I mean, that's a bit... Even though I like the cat, I like, like, like that. That car's nice. Um, yeah, that's what? a bit disappointing, to be honest, to find that out now, because if I try and book another port adventure, then it'll probably be all booked um, and taken, so I'm going to have a look at that just now to see if there's anything I can do at Nassau now. Yeah, that's what it is. And then my bag. I was just walking down the, the, the hallway, the corridor, and I see my bag, which was at least 20 doors away from my, my door, so yeah, I found that strange. But anyway, what time am I on? I know that was a really long clip probably. Um, and if you've watched all the way through, then fair enough. I, I, I appreciate that because it's it was a long, long clip that I probably put in. But that was the my first time. My, my first time and I wanted to document it really. So I can watch it as well and watch back on it. So that was the Sail Away Party, which was really cool. Uh, because it is the silver 20, the 25th silver anniversary of the cruise line. So the outfits that the characters had on were all based on that as well and the first time I've seen it so that was really cool and getting to hear the horn being on the ship and leaving port and just being on the ship really it's just, it's just I, I last time I was on a ship I was I was a I was young really young so it's really smooth just now for now hopefully it stays like that <laughs> but yeah I'm just gonna chill the time is Already 20 to 6 already, so I'm not sure what I'm going to do, I think I might go and watch the show. Uh, the show is, let's have a look, might as well have a look at it just now since, yeah so it's a, a show, I'm not on, it's at the Walt Disney Theatre, uh, I am not able to record it, um, it's called Disney Seas of the Adventure, so that's at half past 6. And that's for 30 minutes and then I have a reservation um, you do get allocated uh, food as well I don't know how I'm gonna, if I'm gonna go or not see how I feel it's quarter past eight so it's already reserved so it's like pre-booked as such quarter past eight the 1923 the Walt Disney uh, restaurant deck three so yeah it's already kind of cheap, but I'm going to show you this now. Yeah, makes sense. Oh. There. So, even your table, table 215, that tells you what attire. So, yeah, just as well. I don't have a suit, but cruise casual. So, I see how I feel. I'm tired. I do need to relax a little bit, and I do intend to use this cruise to relax as much as I can because I've had a heavy week there, I love my week there at Walt Disney World going back to the parks and and everything so that was that was amazing but I need to relax, I need to get some rest, I need to get some sleep, I need to get some chill uh, of course I'm going to show a lot of the ship, I'm going to go off the ship as well and explore if I can and where I can so yeah, join me for that of course but anyway, I'm going to relax just now and then possibly I'm going to go see, see that show and then I'll see what I'll do for dinner and that's really where I'm at just now, so I will see you all very soon. And for now, you can have a look at the view that I have on the balcony. So I only chilled for about maybe 10, 15 minutes. Uh, I won't be reading my hat. Um, I'm going to go watch that show. Something to do, so I'm going to go to Walt's uh, Theatre and watch that show. Yeah, I think it's a half an hour show, so I might as well go uh, and give it a go. So, yeah, let's go watch that. I don't, obviously, I can't record it, but I'm going to go to it uh, and watch it, of course. So, yeah, let's go with that. Let's get my key. So it's saying level 4, 
three and two, two, three and four. So let's go to level four. Let's go by going forward that way. I don't know why I got so confused, so it took me a few hours to, <laughs> to figure it out. Oh. Wow, look at this. This is stunning, absolutely stunning. This is better than a, I guess a lot of cinema, but it's not a cinema. But theatre-wise, incredible. Absolutely incredible. So the show that I'm just about to watch is Disney's Seas the Adventure, which is exclusive to a Disney Wish. So I'm looking forward to, to giving that a go. I might actually move my seat because this bar is right in my way here, so I'm gonna go find another seat I think. That's a much better seat now. Much better. Look at this one here. Wow, wow, wow. What a show that was. What a show that was, absolutely amazing, amazing, amazing show. Wow, blown away. I'm going back to my room just now, uh, just to get a quick change, but just maybe change my top. What a show, what a show that was. Yeah, live performances, the whole lot. Yeah. Wow. Right. Right. Let's go in the room and get a little light change. Um, obviously, yeah, I couldn't, couldn't record in the theatre. How do I explain it? Um, I don't want to give too much away. Basically, all I can say is you, it's a must. You have to go and see that. Yeah, you need to go and see that. So, depending on when your seating is for your dinner, on the your kind of embarkation when you board, so I'm the later on seating, quarter past eight I think it was. So that was my showing, and I think it shows again afterwards. For so if your dinner's just now seating, then you can go and see afterwards. So I think that's the case. But yeah, try to take all that in. Wow, absolutely blown away. Live performances, and. Uh, very very unique, very unique, yeah, loved it, loved every second of it, uh, I didn't want it to finish, put it that way, I did not want that to finish. Uh, right, this is my view just now I'm looking at, in case you're wondering why I wasn't looking at the camera because I just can't take my eyes off that either. I'm finding it very overwhelming just now to be honest for once, so yeah it's so cool, so so cool. I've also met so many people as well, just people, just gen, generally nice people, just people that you kind of bump into, like we're all kind of lost and trying to find our way and you just get talking, or oh, where are you from and all that kind of stuff and yeah it's nice, it's nice that, um, so if you watch this video and we bumped into each other thank you, it's just been good meeting you so far and we've only just started our journey here on the, the wish so I am going to kind of unpack a little bit, not everything to, to be fair, what time is it just now, it is quarter past seven, so quarter past seven just now it gives me a bit of time to unpack, unwind and then change a little bit, so that's my plans. Yeah, so I'll see how I feel about the dinner, I do want to try and give it a go, I'm not too sure how I feel about it. Not that it's like, a, yeah, it's a little bit awkward, I suppose, because I want to sh show what the options are and all that kind of stuff as well and bring that over, but I'm just finding it a lot, it's, not, it's a lot to take in, so much going on, but yeah, we'll, we'll go on with it, we'll move on and uh, let me get changed. Why am I? I look sunburnt. It's a light. Hey, <laughs> yeah, I'll get changed and then we'll, we'll see how we got on. Early days so far. I've had a quick change, freshen up, and I'm going to go to dinner. It's about 8pm just now. My seating time is 8.15, like I probably mentioned. So let's go. I'm not really hungry, um, but I'm going to go. I say hungry, I'm probably going to finish the whole lot. Um, but yeah, let's go. And 
I don't know how much I can record, that's that's the kind of thing as well. I don't know if I can record myself there, I don't know if it's going to be intimate, I'm going to be in amongst everyone else. I don't really know how it's going to work, so let's go. I believe the restaurant is on deck three, which is kind of mid level, or what do they call it, mid deck, I think. It's not in there. Do I look at that? Right, let's go. How fancy does this look? Very well. It's a pleasure having you on board. Thank you. First time wanted this wish? Yes. Alright. Hello, good evening. Hello. How are you doing? I'm good. Just double check. You're Really nice food, and I was sat with a nice group of people as well. So, yeah, that was really nice. Really recommend that. I'm going to head, well, I'm going to walk around the ship just now and then head back to my room and then I recap on what's been an awesome, awesome, awesome day so far. Come true! 
stores here. I'm going to get myself a little souvenir before I forget. Some chocolate here. I'm going to get a little magnet. I might get a t-shirt. Or a jumper. Uh, what's that a card? What's a pop up? We got that as well. And a t shirt. I like this t shirt. This is the front. Make get that as well. Yeah. Yeah. I've got my size, I do have my size. I'm going to get this t shirt. I really like it. Yep, I'm going to get that as well. The ship goes forward and forward. I am walking forward. This way is forward. Now that I figured out which way is forward. Right, let's get in the room. I clicked record quickly as I walked in because I seen something under the bed, and that's what is that? Like a big octopus. It's like that thing from Pirates of the Caribbean. Oh, what's his name again? No, oh, what come to me? Plus, chocolates. How nice is that? It's really cool. Right, um, what am I doing? I am going to... Yeah, just get settled just now um, and then I'll show you this stuff that I got. I know I showed briefly in the store, kind of briefly. I sometimes forget what I click record on, so I'll show you anyway just now in more detail and give you the kind of prices as well, so yeah, I'll show you that. And a little bag as well. This is the cruise line bag. It wasn't free, it was a dollar, but it's worth, it's worth it. So, yeah, let me show you what I've got. So I've got this t-shirt. It's a really nice quality t-shirt, to be fair. That was $35. Really nice. Doesn't have much inaugural ceiling. Just, I like getting t-shirts because you can wear it. And plus, obviously, it's a uh, souvenir, a reminder. This is like a pop-up card. 
You see there? Again, I don't think I'll probably open it. I don't think I'll open it, but I'll keep it at that. And then magnet. Fifteen dollars for a magnet, but I suppose where else you're going to get this magnet? That's why they charge that. So nice little memento. And the one dollar bag, which is probably the best value you'll spend, isn't for a souvenir. Really cool little bag there. So yeah, that's that's it. Unfortunately, I wish the day could just carry on and continue forever and ever and ever. Can't believe that I'm on my first ever Disney cruise. Yeah, I don't know what to say. The I'll recap briefly. It's been a long, long day. Uh, leaving All Star Music Resort. Loved that resort, by the way. For my last kind of couple of days uh, staying there. I left there an hour and a half, which wasn't too bad. It was actually kind of went by really quick. Hour and a half bus journey was thirty nine dollars one way uh, by Disney Cruise Line. If I remember, if you want, I'll try and put the phone number. You need to phone if you and to phone Disney Cruise Line whilst you're here, uh, if I remember. So if I don't, apologies, but I'll put it in the description box down below. So yeah, got here, smooth sailing uh, through the check-in desk and security, and then boarding, and you've seen the rest. Uh, you've seen it all, but yeah, that was really good. Got on the, got on the ship, see, I stopped saying boat. I got on the ship. Quite early, I think. Uh, so I got to spend a lot of time. Got to uh, go backwards on the ship. I, I, I have no idea why I thought I was at the back of the ship. I'm at, I'm at the front left hand side, quite close. Um, I'm on the tenth deck. The eleventh deck, right above me, is where the food is, the free food and the free drink. So that was my thinking behind it. So I'm kind of near all of that. I can just go straight up. And help myself come back. That's my, that, my, that was my thought um, of it. So far, I recommend it because it's quite easy to get to. So, just I know there's lifts kind of the same uh, for everyone. But uh, yeah, I find it quite handy uh, so far. So, we'll see how that goes. I'll update you as the vlogs and the days go. But yeah, went to food there. Initially, obviously, because I'm myself, I thought it would be a bit strange, but. The next table you sat together. I think it's the same group you're you're with and the same uh, waiters that you're with. And uh, as the days go, so tonight was um, waltz. I keep forgetting that. I keep forgetting it. What, is, what was that again? Oh. I'm gonna stay on. Stay on. It's gonna be a long vlog. Dee -dee -dee -dee. Dee -dee. That's the Disney World app. I just keep clicking the wrong app. Disney Cruise Line app now, I'm on. So... Oh no, I think it's past now. Anyway, box restaurant, I was at. <laughs> um, and... Yeah, great, great, great bunch of people. So if you're watching this, really nice to meet you. Uh, thank you for taking the time to talk to me and get to know me. And tomorrow it's the Marvel uh, one, and then it's the uh, Frozen. The restaurant afterwards so I'll give you the proper names as we go to the days don't worry I've just got a lot to take in uh, for my first time on a Disney cruise so yeah had the food there a little walk around spent more money on merch and uh, well not really merch but souvenirs and uh, listened to some music and I think the the light thing in the lobby is called it a kiss good night and I think they do it at different times so Someone did say, if you lie down, I don't know if they were just saying that so they could get me to lie down, but if you lie down and look up, you get the best, uh, I don't know, I don't know, best uh, kind of view or reaction, I don't know. So I don't know if that's the, that was the uh, a Kiss Goodnight, or there's one later on, or there's a few of them, I'm not too sure, so if you do know, again, leave a comment down below for everyone to find out. Yeah, and I sit in back in my room, I've got to chill for the rest of the night. I am really tired, but I don't want to go to sleep because I don't want the day to end, but I need my sleep because tomorrow is Nassau, so I'm going to leave it there. 
thank you if you've watched all the way through because it's probably going to be a long vlog and I've kept quite a lot in there probably just because I want to document this and watch it back myself as well so thank you if you watched all the way through thank you if you hit subscribe and um, thank you for your support and comments and everything as well as always so until the next video I'll see you all then bye bye